Hello, Katie here. Today I'll be showing you how to do an XML reset of an IPC camera. First we need the Dower toolbox. You can download that from dowersecurity.com and go into your region in the top right. Then we're going to go to Support, Download Center, scroll to the bottom and select Tools. Now scroll down again and select Toolbox. Then one more time, Download. I'm going to show in folder and then extract the file. Now double click. Here you need to follow the standard install procedure and follow the on screen instructions. Select I agree and then continue. Do this twice. Just going to minimize everything as we no longer need it. We are waiting for the software to load and let us install the config tool. However, my software actually crashes here and I have to reopen it. Once the software is loaded and the icons go green, we now need to install config tool. This is the end of the install and setup procedure. Now we are going to start with the password resetting. Now we're going to open the config tool and select I agree. Here we can see our camera we need to reset. We're going to select password reset on the left hand side, then select reset on our device. Here you can follow the on screen instructions. Browse to a path that you'll easily be able to find. In my case, I use my desktop. I'm just going to pull the file in onto my screen so you can see it. This is the file you need to send your local DAWA support email address. Be sure to check this, otherwise your file may be rejected depending on your region. Here, I'm going to use Outlook for my email client. In my case, I'm going to craft an email to the UK team since that's where I reside. Once the email has been crafted, be sure to attach your file to the email, then click send. We now need to wait for a reply. In my experience, this can take up to an hour. I'm going to jump ahead here. As you can see here, the email has arrived with an attachment. We are going to download this attachment. I'm going to click and drag it to my desktop next to the original file. We are now going to browse to the file, which you can already see is on my desktop. So we select the results and then click open. By clicking next, it will now ask us for the new password we want to set. In my case, just simple admin123. As you can see here, it was successful. We will now go over how to do this if the camera is not in the same IP range. Here we have a camera on a strange IP address. We need to check our IP address and then change it. First we're going to open control panel, then we're going to select network and internet, then network and sharing center. Now select adapter settings on the left. In my case I will be using ethernet. For you, you might have various connections. Use the one that is active. So we need to right click and then go to status. Then I'm going to select details to see my current IP address. As you can see here, my IP address is completely different. The first three segments should be the same to allow me to communicate with the device. We need to change this. So we're going to close this window. Then I'm going to select properties. Then I'm going to select IPv4. Then properties again. Here I'm going to use the following IP address. For the IP address, I'm going to use 10.1.1.100. And the subnet mask must be as follows. The rest of the boxes do not need to be filled out. Click OK when ready. 
and then close, and then close again. We can now head back to config tool and refresh the screen. Now we can proceed as usual. We're going to do password reset just like before, however I'm going to go through it a bit quicker this time. So follow the on-screen instructions, select where you want to export the file. The file is exported successfully. And now we email this again to your local DAO support. However, with the change I just made, I'm no longer on the internet. So I need to change my IP settings back to normal. So I'm going to right click properties, IPv4, then properties again and select obtain automatically. Then click on OK, then close. Given it just a few seconds and I'm back on the internet. So now we can craft the email just like before. While watching this video, I'd like to ask you to hit the thumbs up icon as it will not only help me, but it will help other installers, engineers and end users. This will increase the visibility of my videos and help others find this valuable information. Now the email has arrived with the attachment just like before, put this attachment onto the desktop And now we need to change our IP details again to be able to communicate with the camera. So here I'm going to change adapter settings, right click, properties, IPv4, then 10.1.1.100. Then OK and OK. I can now go back to config tool, use this file to import and successfully change the password. Thank you for watching. If this method did not work for you, please check out my other videos on resetting devices. If those don't help either, please contact your local DAO technical support team and they will be able to help further.